What's up my pre-calc people? I'm Michael Prinjak and in this video, I wanna to talk to you about how you are gonna master AP pre-calculus this year and pass the AP exam in May and maybe even get a five on the exam so you can do really, really, really well. Now in this video, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the course. I'm also gonna talk about the prerequisites that you need to know to really succeed in this course. Now the AP pre-calculus course is in its third year of existence and last year the scores were absolutely amazing. Worldwide there were 253,000 test takers with a mean score of 3.55 and an 80.8% passage rate. In fact if you compare to other AP math and computer science courses it had the highest passage rate out of all of them coming with 81% of students that scored a 3, 4, or 5. And in certain regions of the country, the scores were even higher. For example, in the state of Ohio, the average score was 4.11 with a 93.3% passage rate. Passage rates that high in a large region like Ohio are almost unheard of. Now, a lot of students ask, does this mean that the test was curved? No, absolutely not. On the multiple choice question, you either have to be right or wrong. And on the free response question, you have to be pretty spot on to get the credit that you need to get a good score. Now, does this mean that the course is easy, that you don't have to study it all? <laughs> Absolutely not. The test is actually quite hard, and the course has a lot of tough components to it. But what you do need to do is be prepared. That's exactly what we're talking about in this video, is how to make sure you're going to be prepared for the AP Pre-Calculus course. Now, who should be taking AP Pre-Calculus? Well, as long as you have successfully completed Algebra 2, trust me, you are ready for AP Pre-Calculus. Now, College Board says that AP Pre-Calculus provides students with an understanding of the concepts of college algebra, trigonometry, and additional topics that prepare students for further college-level mathematics courses. So what this means is that if you are planning on going to college and taking any type of math courses whatsoever, AP Pre-Calculus is exactly what you need to make sure you are going to be ready for those courses. Now, a lot of students wonder, is AP Pre-Calculus kind of a worthless course that I don't even really need? Well, actually it's not true. If you are not gonna take AP Calculus next year, then taking AP Pre-Calculus is actually a really, really good course to make sure you are ready for college level mathematics courses. Now, even if you are gonna take AP Calculus next year, it's still an amazing course because what it's gonna do is it's gonna prepare you for the rigor of an AP course. It's going to have an exam that's very similar in structure and nature to the AP Calculus test. That way you can really practice the skills and the test taking strategies that you need so that you're even more successful next year when you do take AP Calculus. Before you start AP Pre-Calculus, College Board has actually laid out several prerequisite skills that you have to be good at in order to succeed in AP Pre-Calculus. Now, you don't have to be perfect at all of these skills, you just have to be familiar with them, remembering them from Algebra 2, and that way you're going to be really, really ready to jump right into AP Pre-Calculus. Now, let's talk about what these prerequisite skills are right now. Proficiency with the skills and concepts related to linear and quadratic functions, including algebraic manipulation, solving equations, and solving inequalities. Proficiency in manipulating algebraic expressions related to polynomial functions, including polynomial addition and multiplication, factoring quadratic trinomials, and using the quadratic formula. Proficiency in solving right triangle problems involving trigonometry. Proficiency in solving systems of equations in two and three variables. Familiarity with piecewise functions. Familiarity with exponential functions and the rules of exponents. Familiarity with radicals familiarity with complex numbers, and familiarity with communicating and reasoning among graphical, numerical, analytical, and verbal representations of functions. Now, these are the different skills that you need to be good at to be prepared for AP Pre-Calculus. Now, you don't have to be a Jedi master at all these things. You just have to be familiar with them. Then I have a document that's going to make sure of exactly that. It is a prerequisite skills document that has practice problems over all of these different prerequisite skills. And to access this free document, all you got to do is look in the description to this video, and there's a link, and all you got to do is click on it, and you'll get this document. Now, if you want the answer key to this document, then you're going to have to head over to the Ultimate Review Pack. Packet. Now, what's the ultimate review packet? Well, it's your one-stop place to learn and study and practice AP Pre-Calculus. Now, first, if you log into this completely for free, at the very top, you will see a spot for the prerequisite skills. And you will see the full answer key to all of these questions, as well as videos that go over each section as well, in case you really are struggling with some of the problems and you want to know how to do them. But let's talk a little bit more about what the ultimate review packet has. Every single unit, and there's only three units of AP Pre-Calculus, is enormous. What I've done is I've broken down all the units into small sections so you could best understand them. I have a study guide for each of the sections with tons of practice problems, practice multiple choice questions as well, and practice sheets with 
basically more practice problems so you can really learn and study all the different topics of APP calculus. And at the end of the ultimate review packet is a full practice exam. In fact, there's actually two full practice exams to make sure that you are really, really ready for APP calculus exam that you'll be taking in May. And there's tons of other things that are going to help make sure you review, including practicing multiple choice questions, practicing for response questions, and well, honestly, tons more. So please check it out. Totally free to sign up. And the most important thing is that the prerequisite skills, information, answer key and videos are all in there. And that's exactly what you're going to need to be prepared and successful in AP Pre-Calculus. So I hope you are ready for AP Pre-Calculus there. And trust me, as long as you successfully completed Algebra 2, you are going to do just great at AP Pre-Calculus. And if at any point you hit some struggles, please check out my YouTube channel. I literally have a video over every single topic of AP Pre-Calculus to make sure that you could relearn it or learn it for the first time, whatever it needs to make sure you're gonna succeed and do really, really well in the course. All right, check out that prerequisite skills document and best of luck.